Robin Torres here, broker owner of Coastal Georgia Alive Realty, formerly associate broker with Keller Williams Realty. With over 18 years experience, my team and I are well qualified to help you with all of your real estate goals. We are here to serve you in the Brunswick, Golden Isles, Richmond Hill, Hinesville, Savannah, Hooler, and Rinkin areas. Visit us on the web at www.coastalgeorgialive.com or call us directly at 912-247-9786. This guide is designed to inform you about all of the steps of selling your home. We want you to feel confident, make informed decisions, and act as an educated seller. Listing agreements are made between a real estate broker and you, the seller. A real estate agent works for the licensed real estate broker. The commission for the sale of your home will be paid to the real estate broker. The real estate broker will pay a split of that commission to the seller and the buying agents where applicable. You can learn more about the Fair Housing Act at www.hud.gov. The Multilist Service is a proprietary database of all properties currently under an active listing agreement. All active agents and brokers who belong to the MLS will have access to the information about your property listing. Buyers agents searching for a new home for their clients will learn more about your property listing through the online database. Real estate portal websites such as Zillow and Realtor.com are database aggregators. The marketing information on your listing will be syndicated to these real estate portals in order to draw in the largest possible market of interested buyers. Before signing your listing contract with me, I will offer you a competitive market analysis on your home's value. We will set the final asking price of your home based on this market value estimate. When you receive an offer on your home, the buyer's lender will request an official appraisal of the property from a licensed appraiser. In addition to an official appraisal, most interested buyers will request a home inspection before the final sale. A professional inspector will check on the structure, construction, and mechanical systems of the house. This usually includes checking the following. When you receive an offer on your home, the buyer's lender will request an official appraisal of the property from a licensed appraiser. When an interested buyer is scheduled to see your property, it is important that you and your family and any pets that you own vacate the property during this time. Here's more information that will be helpful for you in regards to listing and showing your home. Now we'll cover the cost of selling your home. Your mortgage balance is the remaining balance on your original home loan. Home equity loans have to be paid off as well. These are also known as second or third mortgages. Prepayment penalties are actually rare nowadays, but these are fees that a bank could charge you to pay your loan off early. Check with your lending institution to see if these penalties would apply. All closing costs are disclosed to both the buyer and the seller in the settlement statement at closing. It is very common in our economy and marketplace that buyers come to the table asking for the seller to help them with their closing costs. It is highly advisable that we budget in your net to seller estimations to help 
with some of the closing costs. This is a negotiable item. We will go over more details and a breakdown of the pricing options during our listing consultation. Here are a few things that we will be considering. When it comes to listing your home, there are no single set of black and white rules regarding potential property improvements that apply to every property and every seller. Having your home staged for showing is a very critical point. We will discuss this further during our listing consultation. I am a certified home stager and can help you through this process. There are some key points to home staging to get you started. They are as follows. Moving is certainly an emotional process and can create seller stress. We are here to help you through this time in your life and we will discuss a few items that can help you through this process. We will talk about the marketing plan that we have created specific to your home at our listing consultation. But here are a few things to consider. Every transaction is a bit different, but here are the step-by-step -step points that will take place during your transaction. And remember, we are here to help you through each of these steps. There are so many details to handle as you prepare to move. It seems like a daunting task. We do have a checklist to help you through the process and not to forget anything. We will be providing this at our listing consultation. Here are a few things to think about as you're preparing to move. To help keep your life in order, be sure to keep these things on your to-do list after the sale.